If you clicked on this video, it's probably because you're just like me, starting a YouTube channel, and you're looking for the best audio solution for your YouTube setup. Well, my name's Irving DeYoung, and here's five reasons why I think you should get the Wireless Go 2. And just as a disclaimer, I'm not being sponsored by Go, but I find this product really, really convenient. Wait, I need more coffee. Reason number one, it's wireless. And it's usable right out of the box. There's a built-in microphone right on top that you can use even without a lav mic. And each device comes with a wind muff attachment for when you're outside like this. And if you do have a lav mic and you plug it in the aux port, then you're ready to go. Once you've figured out what setup you want to use, you just put the receiver on the camera and the transmitter to your chest. Be here, or here, or here, or here, and here, or here. <laughs> All this to prove that I'm not confined by a particular space like most other directional mics. And you can still hear me from long range, up to a 200 meter radius, especially because it's usually recommended to stay within three feet of your audio capture device if you want the best audio quality possible. And with this, it's not a problem. I can literally walk off screen. And you can still hear me. This means I can be pointing at anything else and it won't cut off my audio signal. So if you want to do these really, really far recordings, you absolutely can. Yeah! Reason number two, it's versatile. The fact that the GoTo is wireless makes it extremely versatile. It has an aux cord and USB-C system that sends the audio signals straight to your devices, which makes it easy to pair with anything. I can use it on my iPhone, my iPad, my MacBook, and my camera. That covers vlogging, streaming, FaceTime, Zoom calls, and even vocal dubs if you need to re-record some audio. And if you're a film person, you could absolutely use these to grab audio from your actors and sound effects. Reason number three, the Rode Wireless Go comes with two separate channels of audio, which means that if you want to tweak the volume later in post, you can. It's good for interview stuff like this. Excuse me, sir. Is there any particular reason why you're looking for Advil today? My girls give me a headache, bro. Daddy. Reason number four, it's very easy to hide. You may not even have noticed, but the audio that's coming to the camera right now is actually right here. Because the wireless Go is so small and it goes long range, it makes it extremely convenient. Unlike most microphones that make it really difficult to fit in a bag, this device is actually quite easy to stow away. This means you're less likely to feel awkward or get kicked out in public places. And if you ever find yourself in a situation where you need to record some audio, but your camera's not close enough to hear the sound, all you have to do is take the receiver, place it somewhere hidden in the scene, to later sync up in post. Reason number five, it's very easy to set up. The Rode Central app makes it easy to fine tune your go-to without a headache. Need to update? One button. Need a safety channel? One button. Want to set your default channel mode for merge to unmerge? One button. Want to change from a three-step gain input control to a 10-step one? One button. Want to change the power? You get the point. It's simple, and I don't feel like I need to go way too in-depth with all the features because this isn't the video for that. But if you want to see more, I'll leave a couple links in the description below where other people talk about all the features. With that said, appreciate you guys watching this video. And if you want to see more, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you next time. Thank you.